Now, continuing on with the Eye of Horus and Lucifer. And we can see Lady Gaga here doing the Eye and the Triangle. This is a variant of the, just a, one of their creative ways of showing you the Eye and the Triangle. And we all just kind of go, hey, oh no, that's not the Eye and the Triangle. Look at this image. Here is the quintessential uh, Hollywood eye image that we all got from Saturday Night Fever uh, with John Travolta back in the day. But uh, I'm going to show you that they repeat this symbology and this is in fact the eye and the triangle. Another variant of the way to do it. This is that lead singer from Paramore just to show you that they are doing the symbols, all of the symbols at various times um, in this. And I think, believe that this is the same photo shoot um, and so they're showing multiple symbols in the same photo shoot. This is uh, another puppet. And you can see the repetition of this. And this is Katy Perry. Her movie came out in 2012. Her performance at the Grammys um, used occult symbolism as well. You can see that. And you can see that peace symbol back there. Miley Cyrus. And moving on. Now look at this image. This is Michael Jackson back in the day. Now you can say, well, you know, this child doesn't know what he's doing. Just like I told you, if I raise my children up in my belief system, they raise their children up in their belief system. This is a deliberate showing of the eye and the triangle, covering the eye and then showing the eye and the triangle in the left uh, uh, version. So again, it's deliberate. And it's deliberate, and they are raised in this fashion. And whether or not they get out or not, sometimes they even die when they want to get out of this religion. So that is the reality I've come to believe. This is Paul McCartney. And you see Fergie from Black Eyed Peas. And moving along. This is mass, mass programming. Another variant of the way to do it in fashion. Here it is, Rihanna. I don't know who all these people are. This is um, someone who's become uh, popular uh, in this uh, 2011 and 2012. Look at this. They know what they're doing. We would be naive to believe that they don't know what they're doing. When they get to this level, they're in the club, and they are now the ministers of the religion. Alicia Keys on a magazine, another variant of that using the in between the fingers. Here's another variant of that eye. And we'll see other variants in this whole series. Um, Samuel L. Jackson. This is pretty key too. And this is the originators of American Idol. The Bible says uh, idols are not to be worshipped. And of course, we just have these shows that idolize uh, singers uh, up and coming. And so um, you see here now the eye in the triangle, and then she's pointing at that. So it is deliberate, of course, idol worship. Variants. It doesn't matter what genre, who you are, if you're in the spotlight, this is what you do. Annie Leibovitz, I believe she's a, a famous photographer. You don't even get there unless you're playing the game. Unbelievable what is happening. And now this is Korea. Just to show you that this is a global thing, and you'll see some of those uh, images uh, that I have. Not a lot of them, but uh, I've spoken with people around the world that show the same thing with their local puppets uh, in the industry.